Hi guys, Darren here again, and in this video I want to talk about the amp switch on selected Graco models. Now you can find this amp switch on the other side of the box here, so where you've got all your main dials in the front. Uh, the switch is actually, it's, it's actually kind of hidden at the back here. It goes from 16 amps to 10 amps on your 230 volt machines that's on the Mark 7 and Mark 10. And then you also get a 20 amp to 15 amp with your 120 volt sprayers. And you can see that on the 595 and on the Mark 5. Now, we had a customer uh, come in complaining that he was finding that his sprayer wasn't quite performing as it was used to. And he was quite concerned that maybe something was damaged. And he brought it in and we took a quick look at it and it was actually that either him or uh, someone else that was working on the sprayer, they accidentally switched the amp from 16 amps to 10 amps, uh, maybe by handling the hose. And this resulted in the sprayer performing uh, not to its maximum capacity. So with that being said, it means that if you need to be reducing the ampage on your sprayer, so from 16 to 10 or from 20 to 15, you won't be able to run your sprayer at the maximum performance capacity. Now, when might you want to use this switch? Well, there are cases where, for example, the power might be tripping. And in that case, as a, a possible solution, you might, if you're using your sprayer and you're finding that it's, it's cutting out, then uh, try reducing the ampage on the sprayer if you have that feature. And perhaps you'll be able to run your sprayer without the power at uh, tripping. Also, depending on what region you're in, there are certain countries that will have requirements for the amount of ampage that uh, you can use and also for the, the uh, sprayer voltage that you have. So you might have to make some adjustments using the amp switch depending on the power supply that you're getting uh, out of the wall. So with that being said, if you have any more questions on the amp switch, you can just leave a comment below. We'll also have a, a link for an article to assist you in the description. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.